No, we're not speedrunning. We're messing with something very cool in a little while. Hey, Hannah. How you doing? Welcome. Welcome, welcome. Fury is also waking up. Although it's 1 p.m. I got up at 7.30 a.m. But I, you know, whenever I wake up and, like, work on a video nonstop for a few hours, I don't really wake up. So I'm waking up on stream with all you beautiful people. It's fine. All right, so I don't know what this wand was. Was that the second black hole wand? Probably, because it's the same one as this. Is there, wait, was that the one that I got earlier? Or was there a, is that a third? I wish I had something else. I'm gonna use all these to squeeze in there maybe. Eventually we'll get through the stone. Hey. There was probably some dirt. I probably could have dug through that, but, yeah. <clears throat> nope, not that. Yeah, I've already gotten a bunch of 34 orbs. <laughs> but we're not going for that right now. Uh, I've had a run going for, like, six months where I got... We did three 36 orb runs in a row, in one run, and now I'm going for the fourth 36 orb run. So, but we're not doing that for at least an hour from now, because I got other very interesting things. That I've done. That been there, done that. <laughs> Sorry. But, uh, I got to mess with this other really cool stuff. Let's just kill things. I wasn't gonna shoot them with regular stuff, but I just want to find that second. I don't remember exactly where it is anymore. Maybe that's it. I want all of these black hole wands, please. That's not it. This one. Alright. Well, let's keep that for now. Put this over here. Hey, Merper, how you doing? Welcome. Hope you're having a nice day. And Marble Hornet, hello. What's up? So is this the one that works? Yes, this is insane. Okay. Black holes, there might be even more black hole wands in this seed. Where was that? That's an egg. We need to find the Ambrosia. Cut it out. Also, let me, let me make a baby. <laughs> Babby. That's right. Oh, two babbies. Come on, kill the, kill the Kana. Do it. Yes. Yeah, the seed is really stupid. In a good way. Oh. Just as long as I... Don't break that flask. Hang on. So it was over more. It's not... Kick your way in there. I don't want to... Yeah, good. Thank you. Thanks. I just got snapped. Go down there. Where the hell was this thing? <clears throat> I see you now. You blend it in. All right, we got to get this flask. Come here. I don't want to break it by accident. Stay down there, please. No. Whatever. All right, so we got this. Let's just get at it. <clears throat> get out of here now. I don't really care about gold. Uh, yeah, sure. I guess we'll get a little bit more. Maybe.
Yeah. Oh. Where is it? Where's my gold? Did I I black gold it? All right. So now let's put all of these on here. Uh, 1743. What else do we have over here? Azriel, how you doing? Welcome. Want that? Okay. So, so. Let me do other things first, and then I'm going to show you guys who don't know about this. It's pretty new. Um, is that shuffle? It is. Crap. Whatever. Uh, so. Uh, we got to get this. It's nice and cheap. I guess we'll get this, too. So it's, we can have something to fight with that's safe. That might work most of the time. Alright. Uh, okay. So, alright. I'm gonna hold the Ambrosian, Ambrosia flask. Yeah, this is seed number 43. I, I'm using a set seed because I wanted to just play with this. So, dual wielding. Ambrosia. Uh, I set a secondary interact key, period, and a secondary switch to my first item, also period. So in order to get this trick to work, you gotta be holding, it could be a wand, you gotta be holding the thing that you want to bind to yourself, okay? And then you switch away from that thing at the same exact time that you pick up the unlimited spells perk. So that's why I bound them both to one key, and boom. Now, I have a flask of ambrosia bound to my body that I can spray out to become invincible whenever I want. I look like one of those boop enemies from Super Mario 3 or something. Uh, as long as you don't switch back to whatever you bound to yourself, it'll remain bound. Using a flask like this, just moving through liquids is going to capture them in the flask, so it might not be the best, but it's interesting to be able to do this. For a speedrun, if you get teleportadium, you could just, like, use a wand, because you don't have to worry about, you know, you could shoot a wand and go like this, mid-fight, it's fine, you know? So, that's what I want to test. Also, can't save and quit. Yeah, but nobody does that, right? <laughs> yeah. But in a long run, where you might be able to, like a god run, might be able to you know, load in multiple unlimited uh, spells perks, you might be able to do bind a lot of things to yourself. Imagine binding all items, like all item slots and three wand slots on top of your main wand. So you have all these things bound on you at once. Could come up with like cool strategies to just build four really powerful attack wands and then bind them all to yourself for killing the High orb boss. Yeah, it's just hanging out. Mm-hmm. Stuck there. Stuck in my crotch forever. Don't get any ideas. Hey, Buff McLarge. How you doing? Welcome. So, yeah, using like four wands instead of one. If they're all attack wands. Or just like a few. Three, two wands. Instead of one. Just pretty interesting thing. And see, if I go in the water, it's just going to fill up with water, though, too. Yeah, now I have water in there. But you can bind, like, the water stone to yourself. Uh, any of the other stones. Come on. Too much water. Of course, I'm probably going to end up killing myself with it, because... It changes the way I play so much, you know? I'm gonna be, like, trying to spray Ambrosia on myself with one click while trying to fight with the other. Yeah, the thing with that, though, you can't bind the stones because they need to be active, you know? I tried binding a tablet. I was like, what if you bind a tablet to yourself? Can you just walk into things and, like, melee kill them? Or physics kill them? But you can't. It doesn't work like that. You couldn't? Okay. So the coup doesn't work. I didn't try that. I tried... Sunseed and Sunstone are good. If you can survive carrying them around constantly, you know? 
Um, what did I... Okay. What do I even have? I guess... Let's use this. So as long as I don't switch... <laughs> oh, but wait. Oh, so spraying that last filled up that one a little bit. That's funny. Anyway, so like using a flask, probably not the best idea, unless you're just gonna like really stay out of other liquids, especially lava and acid, you know? Okay, you mistyped it. Yeah, I didn't test the coup. I tested a bunch of other things though. I, fi I didn't test the coup last night. I just did it for like 10 minutes pretty much because I figured it's cool. Like, Nymphs especially is going to love that, because Nymphs really likes to use the coup in that way, um, offensively. But, you know, just having this gravity field around yourself all the time could, early game anyway, it's probably not the best idea. Hey, bad scientist, what's up? It goes well, just testing... Testing some things. That was a waste. I don't know why. I did it. At least it didn't suck up all that gold that I'm gonna hopefully get right now before pollying myself and dying immediately. And getting polymorph in this flask. Hmm. But yeah, in a long god run, you could make way better use of this trick. You know? Unless you're doing a fast run, a speed run, or a long god run. Because then you could potentially get multiple unlimited spells and then bind a bunch of stuff to yourself. Or just have more than one chance. Like, if you mess up... Uh... Hmm. Mm -hmm. I guess let's also try bungalow shifting. Why not? Bind great treasure chest. I wish. I wish. Whatever. Hopefully it's not acid and we get it in here. Blood. Okay, so that's nice. Hello. Uh, let's put this all the way out here. And then this right here. And then kill you. Oh, maybe not. And challenge runs, too. So it is really interesting. So just trying to figure out, brainstorm ideas for what you can possibly use it for. But I think stacking wands would probably be the most useful. Other than, you know, like using a flask is not the most useful. Again, unless you happen to be able to get a flask of normal telly, mostly, or unstable for a speedrun. And just to be able to, like, not have to switch to anything, you just, like, constantly use that. <clears throat> yeah, it's not actively held. It's just somehow bugged out and part of my body now. <laughs> yes. So let me, I guess let's just finish this run, maybe. Alright, so... Just don't switch to the other one. Alright. <laughs> I just like the way it looks when you have a flask bound to yourself. It's pretty funny. Hey. It is, yeah. It's a boot. It's a boot. Chainsaws. Uh... Sure. Puke. Blood to puke. Alright. Good stuff. Blood to puke. I don't want Fireball Thrower right now. Um... I guess we could keep those on there. Whatever. Uh-huh. This is a non-shuffle. That's a good non-shuffle. Okay. Do I want this? Yes. 
There, hang on. We don't want that first wand at all. Let me pause. Ruby Rose, I just wanted to thank you for your Sunseed guide. Appreciate it. I'm glad it helped. Um, some of the pillar information in part one or part two uh, may not be completely, maybe a little bit difficult to, may not be worded correctly. So like the new pillar video tells you exactly what you should do to get all the pillar pieces for the Sunseed stuff. If you want to get them, if you want to try to get all the pillar pieces knocked out in one run, pretty much. But appreciate it. I'm glad it helps. Mm. Okay. So, now what? Um, high mana, whatever. Let's just do a basic, whoops. Not that, why am I doing that? Jeez. C straight. I'm not going to use this wand. Actually, yeah, we don't need these, really. I'll just throw them in there just in case. Uh, I would like to use plasma. <clears throat> I'm not going to use that yet. We use this, actually, maybe, and... No, not yet. Not yet. Okay. We'll just keep stuff in there like that. Let's go. I don't care about collapsing. We're just gonna run through this. Live or die. Just so I can look up another seed and try to bind something else to myself that's not this flask of ambrosia. Which, I mean, if I'm if you're gonna fl uh, bind. Ambrosia to yourself. There's like a much easier way to do that, but whoops. Yeah, this sucks. We're gonna get a puke flask. Puke. Oh my god, we almost I wasn't even looking. <laughs> almost got anointed. Take one glance away. Did you see that? That 360 no scope he almost did? What a punk. He was facing the other way and then whoop, the bullet went that way. Those aim botters, man. Too bad I have no gold now. Whatever. Ah. Ah. I should have maybe kept that just so I don't switch to this by accident. Hmm. 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 I'm re-rolling. Whatever. Okay. That's true. But in this game, even more. <laughs> Some of the feats. Did you? Okay, I thought he managed to get a shot off there. Uh, put this like that. <laughs> We're gonna run out of Ambrosia and I'm gonna be SOL. But then we could all, we have this flask bound to ourselves. We could always fill it with something else. You know? So... Whoa! Ow, punk. Puke. Fill it with puke. Whoa! Ow. I should be spraying like a cat. <laughs> no. Ew. <laughs> what the hell? Oh god. This is my my territory. <laughs> I'm all up in your house, eating your food, blowing up your propane tanks, disrupting your barbecue, drinking your whiskey, your moonshine. <laughs> uh. <laughs> I 
Yeah, I don't know. Uh, now it's gonna be full of oil. Gross. Ah, uh, almost empty. I guess we'll fill fill it with water. Magical water flask. All right. Five hundred and fifty-six gold. All right, now. Hmm. Maybe that. Mm, all right, let's just do. It doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Let's just do that. For now. Um, more puke? Yeah, let's get more puke because blood is puke. Yeah, yeah. Sorry. Yeah. We shifted blood to puke, so why wouldn't we get that? Now, what other perks do we have besides, okay, yeah. Meh, hey. Stop it. Ducks. Yes. All right, let's just run. Get them all in there. Ow, I blew up myself with my own duck. Cut it out. Get them, my rats. I'm bleeding rats. That are bleeding rats. That would be cool if you could. Just get a constant, ugh, unending stream of rats. I don't know why I didn't spray myself with water sooner. Yeah, that was, uh, yes. So ducks, yes. I think I will do that. I think I will throw that out too. <clears throat> he see death before you leave Holy Mountain? I don't know. I get Sometimes, yes. Sometimes right at the entrance is like non-stop death. We have no money. But I love he see base. Mm, we have another angry ghost. I don't want to do that. Let's just take dissolve powders just so we can maybe get through the... Uh, Temple, if we get there earlier, uh, faster. And let's drink all this. <clears throat> Excuse me. Man. All right, is this even working? Yes. Look at all that puke. Yeah, we got. Oh, oh, okay. Stop it. Yes. Let's go. We're totally not going to kill ourselves with this. Any more mana. More puke, too. Let's just empty that water and fill it with puke. I don't want water. Get out of here. Give me the puke. Nothing but the best. Grade A. Is it even emptying? Oh, yeah, it's the second one. Forgot. Grade A puke. Dual wielding is this thing that's stuck to ourselves. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's a new, new, uh, interesting glitch. Totally intended effect that allows you to bind multiple things to your body at once. So you can do things like this, like, you know, have a flask full of something and be able to spray without switching to it. Ay, ay, ay. Oh, uh, now I need to. Ah, stop. Don't kill me. Ah, oh, punk. My duck just exploded my face. Okay. Let's go. Blood. I guess... Hmm. Wait, how is that blood? That's weird. We need more... More puke over here. Thank you all. Okay, don't. Can I get some? No, I can't get any. That's right, I won't be able to because the rats. But it's cool that we can just generate infinite rats. I guess we'll fill it with water then. 
Did Noita just reward your pacifist clear with a bomb? Yeah. Unfortunately, that's extremely common. Mm. Eh. We'll probably teleport into lava if I do that. Boop. Alright, so... Nice. <laughs> I'm liking this. This run is pretty cool. <laughs> I was not intending anything like crazy like this, like synergy we got, but yeah. Nice. Obviously, I wasn't intending that. Oh yeah, we have dissolve powders. Whiskey. Oh god, don't explode my face. I mean, it's a little dangerous without explosion immunity because obviously we spawn these ducks that bleed puke <laughs> and we turn the puke into rats and then they attack each other. The ducks explode on the rats. So maybe, uh, maybe explosion immunity would make this so much better, but I don't think there was any, like any exploding corpses or anything like that. And the wand is pretty decent, too. Hey! Like, for just one-shotting things. Oh, uh, no. Oh, no! Crap. Alright, time to just go. Maybe. Don't... Go away, rats. I mean, ducks. Ow, punk. We got plenty of black holes, so just... Yes, stupid crystal, get out of here. I'm gonna be careful. Nice and careful. Famous last words. Play nice and slow, because I want to get this victory, please. Stay away from me, ducks. Even though, you know, if we end up killing ourselves, that's fine. As long as we don't get killed by one of these things, I'll be happy. Ugh. What is with a potion? Oh, yeah. Well, that's what the dual wielding thing is. After this run, I'll explain it again. Please don't die. We're almost at the bottom. So you can... Alright, I'll try to explain it real quick. Um, let me just get this gold, maybe. You can bind any item or any wand to yourself if you are holding it. And then you switch away from it <clears throat> on the same exact frame that you pick up the uh, unlimited unlimited spells perk. So what I did, so it was discovered by Smickles by accident, and then Alias kind of figured out like how it worked, and we're testing more stuff out. So I bound interact and switch to first slot with period. So you just press one key, just bind those two things to one secondary key. And then as soon as you pick up, pick up the uh, unlimited spells perk while holding something with that, and it'll allow you to bind those two things together. And then you could do stuff like this, which we had it full of ambrosia throughout the first half of the run. Uh, or you could bind two wands to yourself or multiple. If you get multiple of these, you might be able to bind multiple like or what stack four wands together or attack wands so like get four boss killers stack them all together and then kill kill Colmy like that and now that i said that of course i have to do that for the next like slow run that i do you son of a all right hang on let's not die via 
our own hand. Okay. Goodbye, statue. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Pretty awesome. All right, we have not enough gold for... Well, oh. <laughs> okay. Well, I mean, that's just begging. Begging me to buy it. Look at all this, though, too. Damn. Damn. Lots of... Wait. All right. We were just talking on the Discord about wands that have higher than 26 capacity and how rare they are. There's, like, an ins extremely rare chance to get a wand that has even higher capacity. Like that. Could I have rerolled? I didn't even check. I think I may have been able to. Um, we're not using this. I'm sorry. We will not. I was gonna... I want to use this. I mean, we bought this, but... We got aiming arc with this, so it's, like, perfect. But I don't want to... I've done that so many times. You guys have seen that so many times. We don't need to do that. It's unnecessary. If I had another trigger, I would put it on here too. All right. Yeah. No. Fine. All right, let's go. Comically Black Man. Thanks for the follow. Thought it's modded for a sec, but exploits of this game have a charm of their own. Yeah. Lots of really interesting exploits. We have to kill Colmy with this setup, because it's just so cool. <laughs> and he's dead. <laughs> Let's do it. Wait, now we gotta kill ourselves, I guess, with it. Two-shot Colmy. That was nice. I like that. Good stuff. All right. Hurry up. Kill me. No, it's not gonna. All right. Well, this run's getting uploaded. That was awesome. Quack. It was fun stuff. Yeah. Colmy just got quacked up. Quacked into pieces. That was run number one, or win number 1920. 1920. First and first ever, my first ever dual wield win, yes. I don't know if it was world's first. I'm sure Alias probably did. I'm sure. <clears throat> I just found out about this last night. I think uh, it's only been maybe a few days that people have known about it, though. Okay, so good stuff. 18,000 plus deaths. Of course, I'm a speedrunner. 